M0FXB, welcome to my channel. Just a quick look here at the Bofeng BF1, which is a mini UHF radio. It can be programmed for VHF, but really it's a UHF radio because the, you know, the built-in stubby antenna is 70 centimeters. Now it has a torch at the top, which I think works, works quite well. Nice display, there's no keypad, and you do have to program this radio using programming software, which is free, but the cable is about five pounds in the UK. Um, it has broadcast radio, there you go, uh, up and down. Now it does come with, you know, some 70 centimeters pre-programmed in it, uh, like so. I haven't got the cable yet, so I've not been able to do that. You've got your Bofeng type menu, up and down, with the different usual settings that we expect from Bofeng. And then you've got your torch, which I think actually works quite well. And uh, it has a, this particular model is the newer model, has a battery, a lithium battery. You can just take out in the belt clip on the back. Um, your, it does come with three, three sets of headphones with a, with a PTT built into them. And um, SOS button here, on off button at the top. And unusually, a micro USB for charging and programming. So, and I, I did see the programming um, CPS, and I, it's very good, like a bit like Chirp, probably works on Chirp. Now the Yaesu 4XE, you've got a menu here. This is two meters 70, you have a keypad on the front and DTMF, can't see DTMF on this, unless it's in the programming software. Trigger type PTT, emergency button. No torch that I know of. Um, let's have a look here. Up Now here, you've got your menu button here, menu, like so. And just hold it down. There you go, it's pushing a bit harder. And then it is a Bofun style menu, I would say. I know it's a Yesu, but go up and down. It's the usual settings. I mean, it's a £65 radio, this, and it's, I think it's well worth £60. It's very good quality. Similar kind of battery setup, I suppose, to this. Now, these are like £15. So this is a bit of a toy that you just throw in the glove compartment or put in your pocket. And when you're out and about, once you've got your favorite 70 centimeter repeaters and simplex channels programmed. And I suppose it's quite handy that you can just listen to the broadcast radio as well. You know, that is a handy to have in your pocket. Um, like you just push it and you listen to the radio. The 4XC does have a sort of a monitor button. So you push that and it zeroes off the squelch as well. It's quite handy having a, having a keypad, isn't it? Programmable buttons as well. Got your band button down here. Two meters seventy. Programmable buttons there. That that top one is set to set to, set to frequency step, and the bottom one is tone. But you can change that in settings. Once you hold this down and go through the menus, you got squelch, step, tone, power. VFO, weather alert, backlight, beep, CW, what's that? Lamp there, LEDs, memory tags, all kind of stuff. So anyway, there you go. Just thought I'd show you these side by side, being I have them both here. And uh, yeah, let me know what you think. Would you buy a pocket radio for £15 like this? I don't know. It's like, uh, it's like buying a big box of chocolates, isn't it? And you can use it for as long as you like. You can probably still sell it for a tenner. So 7-3, thanks for watching my channel. Catch you on now. All the best.